Before we get into the video, guys, I am giving away 11,500 Apex coins. To be in with a chance of winning them, make sure you are subbed to this channel. Drop a like on the video and leave a comment down below. What is going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel, and I appreciate you being here. Guys, I apologize about my voice. I've got a blocked nose, I've got a sore throat, I've got a man flu, and it's killing me. But today guys in this video I bring you another Apex Legends video and today I have some information on two new characters coming to the game. But before we go any further guys if you do enjoy the video leaving a like really does help out and I do appreciate the support. Okay so a few hours after Apex Legends was released to the world we got a trailer for the game. If you haven't seen it you'll find it linked within the video description. It's the ending of the trailer which is of an importance. So at the end of the trailer it states more legends to come and then we see two legends in the distance which we can't really make out but actually guys we have made out who these characters are a big thanks to those smart bastards over on reddit for the heads up that reddit post can be found linked within the video description if you do want to check it out if we zoomed in we can easily make out these characters well not easily we can kind of make out who they are the dude on the left is a robot pilot looking dude and the one on the right looks like a human with a jetpack on his back and you can see this by this zoomed in video on screen now. So the guy on the left is believed to be this red hooded pilot which was originally a concept for Titanfall but was never used. Now if you didn't know, Bloodhand was also a concept unused from Titanfall and put into the world of Apex Legends. Seen by this image on screen now from an original guide for Titanfall. So respawn using characters which were cut from Titanfall and adding them into Apex isn't anything new as it kind of makes sense as they're both a part of the same world. Also people I think we need more robots, that's for sure. Pathfinder is great but we need more. The guy on the right who looks to have some kind of jetpack tech on his back is believed to be this guy seen on the screen now. His name is Taosham and he is a Korean legend. This picture is actual artwork and is taken from the Pathfinder artwork which you may have already seen as you see on the screen now. You see this Taosham in the background. And like I said, it's now believed to be this Taochum legend who we see in the trailer with some kind of jetpack on his back. He's also believed to be the first legend to offer some kind of double jump. But if I were to guess, I'd say maybe this jetpack will come into play with his abilities and maybe his ultimate ability. Maybe activating his ability will allow him to have a boost jump of some kind and his ultimate allowing him to maybe hover for a few seconds in mid-air. But we will see people, we will see. But yeah, new legends we know are coming. Looking at the roadmap, it's believed we will get two per season and do mean that next season. So these two characters may just be coming in June guys, but we will see. So guys, you tell me, what do you want to see from a new legend? Do you want to see more robots and how do you feel about a new legend with some kind of jetpack? Do you think something of sort could break the balance of the game? Let me know what you think about this down below within that comment section guys. But on that note, we have come to the end of the video. Just a quick one showcasing to you guys the two characters believed to be coming to the game in June. If you guys enjoyed the video, leaving a like really does help out. If you are new around here and Apex Legends is what you want to see, be sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video I upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by and hopefully I will see you on that next one